Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about your Squarespace website and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you add a product into your Squarespace account? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to list a product in your Squarespace website anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running an online business selling products or services, it's important to have that offering available directly on your website and Squarespace makes it easy to do that. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process and it's handled here in your Squarespace editor. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I already opened up my Squarespace account and this is the home screen. Now in order to list a product for sale in your Squarespace website, here on the left side, you wanna scroll down until you see this button here called selling. Once you click on there, you're gonna see various options and you wanna click on this button here called products. Okay, so as you can see, there's four different types of products that you can list for sale on your Squarespace website, physical product, services, downloads, and gift cards. So you wanna choose whichever one applies to you. For me, I'm gonna click service. Okay, and next I'm gonna click on add product. Okay, next what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and name the product. So let's go ahead and just name this YouTube Consulting. Okay, next you wanna go ahead and add an image of the product. So think of this kind of like Amazon. You wanna have a good high quality image. If you don't have one, you definitely wanna work on that, but go ahead and add what you have for the time being. So I'm gonna click on this plus icon and add an image. Okay, I chose an image and it's uploading. Okay, this is what my product looks like so far and that looks pretty good. So we're gonna go ahead and click on next. Okay, so now we can go ahead and edit what the product's gonna look like on our website. So first we're gonna go ahead and type in a description. Okay, and next you can go ahead and type in additional info right here. So they let you know this is for a longer description. If you wanna put in videos or other types of content, I'm not gonna do that. And then here we already put in our header image or featured image, and then we can go ahead and add in backup images as well. So for example, if you're selling a physical product, you're gonna have the main image that's gonna be eye-catching, and then other images that are going to describe what that product is. Here, we're gonna go ahead and enter in the price. So let's go ahead and put $500. And then if you wanna put on a discount, you can do that. So the sale price, let's say is 250. Okay, so I'm selling a service, so there's unlimited stock. But if you are selling a physical product, you don't wanna have that. You wanna go ahead and show how much you have in store. So let's say we have 100. Here, you can go ahead and change the SKU if you want. Okay, so here you can go ahead and add different variants of the same product. So you just click on add and then add a description. So the size, the color, material, you can go ahead and add those all in if you have different options. Here you can go ahead and add categories of products. So maybe beach category or maybe bathroom products. And then you can also tag the products. Okay, here on the selling tools, you can go ahead and add another featured product. So for example, if you're selling, I don't know, a toilet, you can put a featured product on that same product page that's maybe related. So maybe shower curtains. Okay, and you scroll down a little bit more and then they let you edit the SEO. So this is what it's gonna look like on search engine. And then you can go ahead and arrange the checkout. So if you think this is gonna be a subscription, like something that you can send out monthly, you can go ahead and add in a subscription. All right, so that looks pretty good as far as adding a product into our Squarespace website. So we're not finished until you click on the save button here on the top right and save. Okay, now it brings me back here to my products page. So now you can see the product has been added into my Squarespace website. However, it's hidden, it's not available until you click right there on that little arrow and then make it public. All right, now my product is available on my Squarespace website. So there you have it guys. If you're wondering how to add a product into your Squarespace website, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.